Greetings everyone and welcome back to Old World Blues, the A to Z series in which we're playing right now as the good old Bone Dancies, as you can see. We've gone ahead and eliminated the Troll War and it was actually probably the easiest time I've ever, ever fought them. And it's not bad, we have everything cored already. Um, because we did finish off Western Roads. Um, but I did do Thriving the Waste, with new, new tools and weapons are thriving pretty well in the Waste, all things considered, in Old Commonwealth Roads. The old roads uh, that used to link up the nation existing in these lands are pretty well done. Roadside communities. Local merchants are starting to build little trading towns on the sides of the main roads, selling goods and services as local community hub. But, as I said in the last episode, we wanted to go to War of the 80s, and my god, it's been a slaughter on us to push through and encircle all these guys over here. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 divisions. And uh, 12 divisions, well, that's, that's the, major, the majority of their army, not all of it. There's still a couple divisions left here and there, but that's definitely the majority of their divisions are encircled, trapped, going to die. And hopefully we can push out this way. At least that's a hope. Hey, nice job. Help them out right there. Because you guys are trapped, once you guys die, we should be able to push out through here and have a good time, basically. Um, we need more money, though. You already get to clear Warner Royal. They were helping us out just a little bit. Uh, but, you know, oh well. I'm not super concerned. I think we'll do okay no matter what here at this point. They're attacking us just a wee bit, which I would probably be too. Um, song for the front. Uh, war support. Ah, uh, sure, we'll use more war support. Why not? All right, everybody, let's end them once and for once and for all. Really. There you go. Um, next uh, focus. Let's see. Backyard scrapyards. Everyone has a little bit of scrap in the backyard. Let's put it to use. Because after this, it's going to be just straight blown through here. And we might just go to a war with New Hammond as well. How many days would it take for us to go to war with them? 55, that's not bad. <coughs> I might go to war with Vault City too, because Vault City is uh, pretty valuable to have. Psychers, very nice, very nice. Good guys in the line, that'd be delicious. Like the flesh. 3, 2, 1, let's go. Yay. Rats, we don't like rats. Also, we did upgrade Crow's Haven quite a bit here. Um, then we can continue to upgrade the node. Level 3, of course, could be better, but whatever. Um, yeah, overall, not bad. How many divisions they got left? They've got less than 10. They have 7, and we have more than triple their numbers, so. Excellent. Good job in Crow's Haven. Wendover. Ease. And while we're doing that, Sacker's done, and we're gonna grab this. Special Forces stuff, I guess. Oh, the communities are nice. Vault City, uh, maybe 21. I oh, don't know. We'll see what happens. Genius encryption. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. And uh, Gamma Gulp uh, Brewery. Gamma Gulp's an old type uh, brew. Once brewed in this part of the wasteland, by using some of the brews, we can start making more of this brew. Brew, 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 brew. Oh, hello. Oh, boy. Uh, do they volunteer the reaction fighting the White Legs? Or Kaiser's Legion? Oh, they actually sent quite a few volunteers. Holy crap, that's a lot of volunteers. Bruh. Brussif. Seriously? How many volunteers can Kaisar send? Dude, that's unfair, man. That's a crap ton of volunteers. You know what? You're gonna hold. Hold for now. You guys finish these guys off. That's fine. That's unfair. A pull crap like that. That's so stupid. Now we might be locked into war here until Kaiser actually goes to war. That's stupid. That's really freaking stupid. Seriously, that's so stupid. One, two, three, four. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 frickin' divisions! 15! Why would Kaiser send that many divisions this way? I feel like they're gonna attack soon. That's more divisions than the, the 80s even have. Bruh. We could try a general attack, but I don't think it'll go very well. We should have air superiority too, so. You guys get through there. 
Maybe you want to turn around and beat him up like that. That'd be nice. How can we not kill them? Bro, now that's complete BS. Come on. That's such BS. Are you kidding me? So basically we have to wait until the war with the Legion is over. Are you... That's so stupid. That's so incredibly... That's the dumbest thing I've seen so far in this campaign. Jesus Christ. So stupid. Kaisar never sends soldiers. Never, ever, ever. Uh, Northwest Commonwealth Army Caches. Little people who live here seem to be sort of good deal things, like the preparation for some sort of perceived invasion from an enemy across the sea, maybe? Yeah, I'm sorry, but this is stupid. This is incredibly stupid. If you can send seven, like 15 divisions, why don't you send your entire army? If you basically did at that point. That's so stupid. Well, it seems like we're going to wait here quite a while then to deal with that. It looks like we'll probably need to increase our stability instead of other stuff. And by southern traders. By inviting traders from the south, we're going to prove the riches of our people. Battle training. We need to train for battle all the time. This way we'll always be ready. Metal detectors. Our scouts have found a neat little toy metal detector. We can use this to detect scrap even underground in local communities. Communities that have sprung up here are numerous and plenty, and then skyscrapers that are in the north northwest. And the skyscrapers are starting to beat your claim. A few can rival us if we settle on the greatest citadels of the old world in the question of cannibalism. For decades, cannibalism has been a big problem among the tribes of Oregon. It is our choice whether we attempt to move away from this practice or embrace it. And then steam machines. A set of pilgrims brought with them designs for proper roadside war machines. We can, With these, we can own the roads wholly. And now, everyone, I got tired of the 80s, and that was such crap from Kaiser just setting all sorts of divisions. So I just like, you know what? Just not use the conquer commands. Not too many, honestly. But just a little bit, because I don't want to deal with it, to be honest with you. Like, when another nation has, like, more than double of your army to help you out. I'm like, I'm not gonna deal with that. Especially something with the 80s. I'm okay. But right now we're at war with the Nevada Free States, Modoc, and the Den because the Den raided us. So it's justified on them. And the Den is a puppet of uh, the Free States. And the Free States, well, they have also, they were guaranteed by Modoc or, yeah, or something like that. But anyways, we're at war with all of them, so. At this point, they all have to die. It only makes sense. After that, hmm, the cause. Wait, the cause? The cause still exists? How does the cause still exist? Uh, what do we lack besides manpower? Guns? You can have a couple more guns if you really want. Planes? That's pretty decent. Thank you very much for playing. And yeah, thank you very much, too. Now, as we continue to destroy Modoc. Well, we're currently doing local communities. What else we got here? Ooh, a little more manpower is very nice as well. Skyscrapers of the Northwest, which I read earlier, but even the skyscrapers are starting to be reclaimed. They can rival us uh, if we've settled in the greatest citadels of the old world. That's very nice. Very nice. Yeah, because the comms go through as well. <clears throat> now, I want as much of Oregon as we can possibly get, so. Uh, Marlock Tribe is probably up on the docket next. Oh, well, God. 115 days. Why? <coughs> Excuse me. And there we go. So, Marlock Tribes, you next. Um, yeah, we should be fine to take them out, not too bad. Uh, but, uh, one of the comments was, uh, continue on with, the, at least at the time of this recording, with the uh, Road to Enhancement videos, and of which I will. Uh, someone says, and I did ask you guys yesterday, though, what we should do, Road to the Bone, or Pact of Darkness. And at the time of this recording, there's more support for... Roads of the Bone. We shall align the 84 of the bones of our conquered foes. Uh, <clears throat> and then let's concrete path of Byron to mark our path in these wastes forevermore. Just sound like a lot of fun. Ah, let's go to now too. I love more attack. And happy February, everybody. I was trying to start quarrying stuff in where the former 80s territories, volatile shack market is fine. 
But I think we read this earlier, but for decades, cannibalism has been a big problem among the tribes of Oregon. It's our choice whether we attempt to move away from this practice or embrace it, but the blood cult. Cannibalism isn't an issue, no, it's just a rapid use of it. We need to refine cannibalism, perfect it. Uh, the corpse culinary. The preparation of a meal is important to the slaver. Finger fillet. Fingers are pretty good when fried and uh, boot button. Boots make for uh, <clears throat> a good bowl to boil the feet in. Well, everyone, the plan was for us to go to war with the Marler tribes, but then the Van Graffs declared war on us as well as the Toon and 15th, so not good. Um, you're gonna, you know what? They want to attack us there. We'll attack them right there then. So be it. So love you. Uh, so yeah, it's, it's not going great, but you know we'll see what we can do right now. Um, excuse me, I don't care about that. Uh, you guys do this. You guys do this. Let's go in if you can. The special forces should be fine. This is going to be very tough to do, though. Uh, I'm not looking forward to it whatsoever, but, you know, whatever. If they want the tile, then they can have the tile. They can die in the tile. As we're trying to get more manpower right now, or really more political power, so we can core more stuff, so we can get some more manpower. Um, so we're doing okay there. They're attacking us, we're attacking them. You know, all pretty good stuff overall. That was a lot of damage. But now with a little more manpower. Ooh, that might be a bit too much. There we go. Um, let's make sure every group has at least some sort of fighter group. Uh, fighters. I'll throw a little more cast. As well. Finger fillet, of course. Boot biting, followed up with a little bit of a grab and takeout. Eating people in your own tribe is probably a bad idea. Let's look elsewhere for meat. Because, my God, do we love the meat or what? Nice, nice, nice. They want to attack there, so be it. They attack us, we attack them. It's a give and take, as we all know. Okay, so things here. You got. Let me tell you just to hold for now. I'm not sure what you guys are doing. Like, I don't. You're just like wasting time here. go. Uh, we need another air base maybe around here, yeah. As much as can in and around there as possible. Doing alright for now-ish. Especially with their superiority, we should do okay. This is going to be very annoying very soon. Yeah, okay, we have to auto deploy some more soldiers then. You go right there. In all honesty, you, you, you have to hold here yourself. There's nothing else you can do. This is going to become a huge problem. We don't stop it now. Alright, plenty of army XP and whatnot. We need more manpower, but what else is new? Uh, we're going to go with special forces. Last special forces, yes. Pretty good. Well, I didn't give you orders, so get some planning done. Come on, get right there so we can circle these guys and kill them off. Oh, come on. Jesus Christ, stop letting him do that. You're gonna force the attack, too. Good. Food biting, taking meals out. Nice, nice, nice. Come on. Find tools, grab some of that. Ah, uh, mind munchies. The brain always tastes the best. Well, I, I wouldn't know that, but sure. Sure, why not? Good so far over there. They're gonna take us again probably very soon. <clears throat> Hopefully, doing a god awful amount of damage to these guys. They're pushing down pretty darn hard, not gonna lie. You can, like, just not, just don't lose, and you go ahead straight for Reno, and capitulate him that way, that'd be fantastic. Uh, you can have a loan. Something's gotta give here, though. Something has got to give. We don't want to get encircled here. These guys are not doing enough. Deep Springs, maybe? Just maybe? 
Craft the city's good. Force it. Ball new Ah, good. Now we're taking what we deserve. Can you get a new Reno too? Yeah, we can. Very nice. Oh, they're cut off right there. Good. Well, that worked out a lot better than for us than I thought it would. I was kind of scared that we would not be able to do that, but whatever. Yeah, since we're here, we must take you guys out too. Might as well, right? Now they just send divisions this way, and they're going to be really screwed over. Um, 87%. Not bad. Munchies. <clears throat> um, ready conscripts. Outside of the towns, they did go this one, get a little bit more compliance gain. It's pretty nice. Pretty little integration. So with that. Honestly, as much as I want to do this one, we're gonna go I'll go better just five all those times and whatnot. Special forces. Lord of Winter. Approved I, ooh. You know what? I never choose that one for this campaign, but still. More infantry top of deals. There you go. Guardian Citadel, yes. Just bulleting them. Shacks. Uh, who's just fine on us now? Okay, the Wildlife Tribe wants to go to war. Let's meet with the uh, Red fla Flag Slavers. Let's have some mass merchants head south, trade with traders, the Flag Seven, in order to grab a few meat sacks. Why not? Go to bed, become a desert fox, and even hill spider. Very good. TV town, huh? Thousand versus four thousand. Not bad. These guys have become encircled. Awesome. Well, we got the cipher done. You might as well use it, right? Good. Good. Just in time for the good old Mylar tribes. Wardens of the White. That's very bright blue. Julius Brandt, huh? That's interesting. A lot of our store in the Wardens of Glory. <coughs> Excuse me. What is this? I've never seen this one before. A little bit of Bulgaria, what the heck? Interesting. That's really cool. Uh, how, how long do it to wait for these guys? It's always so long. Can we take these guys out within a matter of... Oh, they're allied with those guys. God dang it, come on. Bruh. Yeah, maybe we won't take them out then. That really sucks. But we're also going to meet with uh, leftovers of the Raiders. Raiders are always least such a mess. Let's see what their sale price is for it. I'll get to that one earlier. Oh, well. So we can't do any other focuses for now, but that just means we get a lot of political power, which means we can core more stuff, hopefully. So that one's done, which is nice. 100% pretty good, too, here, too. I actually have a little bit of manpower, which is pretty decent. That's what we like. Our cyclone. Good, more mapper is always welcome.
Let's see, you can do some of this. Restore Dog by Proven Ground? Sure. Some more goods. A little bit less research speed, that's worth it. Um, naval Warfare? So we do have enough anti-tank, but we probably want to get a little more piercing as well. North Korea taking in a raid? We could also use hip here. A couple planes. Or air bases, I should really say. That'll be good. Brask matters, we don't like about that organization stuff. Doesn't really matter to us too much either. <clears throat> I'll put some resistance down here too. Ah. And they've got a war with us. Ah. Expensive, but not that bad, honestly. So, what if we were to do that? Can we do that? Yeah, we could. Give me a couple days, so we might get some planes in here too. Yeah, good amount of damage is always nice. Uh, what do we have to do the war with the, these guys, and then only have to fight through here? That'd be interesting. That'd be a little different than fighting through the cause. Oh, but you have the cause as an ally. Never mind then. We fight through here, here, and then up here. 120 days. We have 120 days regardless. We might as well start doing it now. Oh, and there he goes. Goodbye, Clelock. Goodbye. You, we did well. 79. Do that so it makes it easier to get more compliance all over the, all the other places too. Resource production, all right, that's fine. All right, for mercenaries, any parts and stuff. So for the front, we have enough war support. We'll go. To, I'd rather listen to the ink spots. Almost a hundred damage, and it's still not enough. To attack with infantry. That's so bad. They really destroyed infantry, and you know. Auto blues here. Nice gift. Trump is nice though. Prospectors. We were mobilizing for a while here too. Your hold for now. Them attack is just a little bit. Yeah, infantry is pretty garbage. Shucks. Irrigation. Nice. A little more piercing would be ideal, though. There we go. That's all we really need in the end. Alright, so wait a little bit here. So you guys are definitely gonna go on the front line. There's six divisions here. You honestly might be able to do that. And we're gonna hold out here to the waterways. Well, I'll be okay with that. <clears throat> Friends in high places. Seems our recent purchase have caught the attention of rather wealthy group of connoisseurs in the city lights. They're giving us an offer we can't refuse. And rivers of blood. Uh, they are. It has been refined to a razor edge. Let the waste know our cruelty and bloodlust were coming for the next after all. And now we are currently at war with the Washington Brother, which the puppet uh, has the puppet of them. Their puppet. The puppet of the bro Brotherhood, which I can't speak right now, uh, is. is because uh, they lost 8,000, we lost about 5,000. It's a very, very bloody war. That's incredibly bloody. My god, it's been bloody. Uh, so we're going to try to go in here and circle more divisions here. Um, you're going to force the attack. You're going to win here no matter what. Uh, just because we are struggling big time. They have so many divisions. So many divisions. So. Uh, but we're going to finish off with Rivers of Blood, which would be nice. And, ooh, Aerial Warfare. Sure, why not? Get in. Because they're, they're trying their best here. And we're trying our best here as well, but like, my god, it is so difficult. Oh, there's no longer a waterway here. Oh, there used to be one right there. Oh, that's interesting. Um, but yeah, th we're definitely struggling around here. We can do that, maybe. Oh, we'll go right there, actually. Do that to that. You guys go here to there. 
Some doggos would be nice for more garrisons type of stuff. And we got plenty of planes in there. Like, my gosh, we got tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of planes. Uh, it's just a big old grind here. See, as you can see, manpower's gone down just a little bit. Pretty normal, not gonna lie. Uh, but these guys are out of manpower, so that's the most important thing. Yep, out of manpower, the cause. I don't know how they're holding on. They're out of manpower. They're out of factories for the most part. Oh, finally, that stuff is decrypted. And the costume. Thank you very much. You're gonna force it right now. I'm sick and tired of these people. So we've lost a lot of guys, but they've lost a lot too, so. All these tiny little waterways, is, it's a little confusing, not gonna lie. It's a little confusing. Why don't you guys get all the way to Peril District? Oh, Interstate Bridge, huh? Uh, any more space here? Nice, sorry, that was my phone. And boom. Hey, the cause is finally gone, thank God. That was a pain in the butt to take out. And we're done with the rivers of blood. Very nice. Oops. Good. I'm gonna force the attack. No matter what happens, we still gotta continue attacking. Um, anything else here we really care about? We could mobilize more. We could get military academy trained. We could have a good just by war goal sense, but that's not a huge priority for us right now either. This guy's actually encircled. That's nice. Good, good, good. Uh, so we, do we have to go all the way through here? Do they not? Is this not connected? I don't understand. Is it? Is it connected? Man, they all you guys right here. No, you get in there too. Lost about 5,000 versus 13. Not bad. Uh, they have that few divisions. We're going to attack anyways. For spies. Damage, not a ton of, not a ton of damage, but suicide bells. Ooh, Capitol Hill. Come on, go and over here too. Oh, old believers. Oh, what happened? Heaven's Gate must have won. Oh. We got two old believers now. Huh? Good. Slowly trying to break through here. Slowly trying. To, oh, maybe I'm going to get in the circle. That's not good. Not getting circled for the love of God, please. Good, broke through here. Breaking through here. Good all around. Economic research is good too. Don't send everyone over there at the same time. Send them in a different direction. Collapse of Brotherhood Control. Ooh, nice. We linked up here. I'm gonna link up through here too. How many divisions they got left? Up to 22. We have more now, which is awesome. Head down here. <coughs> cool, ninety four. Oh, wow, thousand. Go, 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 go. We're doing quite well, I'd say. Um, since we're here anyways, Crow's Haven. We've been trying to continue to upgrade this place. It takes forever, though. Um, dog goes quite a few. Good. Excellent. Do it again. Yep. Very, very nice. They don't like to count with but they do pretty darn well. Oh, you don't have any extra tank on them. Oh no, they have, they have stuff on here. Um, don't want to throw garrisons on our guys over there just yet. Not a lot of population over here, so don't really want to invest in them. This is worth investing, though. We will eventually need more map though. After them. All parts of Oregon. And the part of the NCR, I'm not really going to go to war with them, probably. 
top and front, and more bullet fire. Well, these guys should be done very soon, too. Ah, good. Got what else do we need? Ah, Yakima. Very nice. They're about to be gone. They only have nine divisions left. I think we've done a very good job with these guys here. <coughs> that hasn't been super easy, but we've done it. And it all helps when you have some uh, trial plane attackers and whatnot, too. Oh, they're trying to hold out. They're trying desperately to hold out. What is that? Ah, that's an entire state. Cool. Hello. Don't let it move. Protection. And we got them! That took really long. We could take their ships, but I'm not interested in their ships right now. Better cybernetics. Better doggos. Better Klamath. We go to the south, it makes it easier to go to the north. Can over search is good. Nice. After them, well, then we'll do or the south, the timber line, and then we'll probably call it a campaign. Three, two, one. With that lack of manpower, oh boy. Good. Drop them like there's no tomorrow. Absolutely, just hopefully, just just destroying them. Church from Hawaii, if you wonder about this, please go ahead. We're gonna get some more oh, stability. I like stability. Almost a desert fox, and we got him. Not bad. Timber line. Looking extra thick from them the last time I remembered them. Well, that could just be me. For your conscription, uh, let's have some countless factory output. We could use that product, probably. We're still mobilizing, just a tiny bit more. A hundred. Uh, new Reno would be, oh my gosh. 85,000. Can we get like 10,000 of that, maybe? Let's see what it turns into. Anything? No? Well, okay then. 12,000 still would be pretty darn nice. A joint of crown. Under governance, bone dancers has prospered. We build downs, communities, roads, and dreams. Whatever advisors noted today, noticed today, that walking through new regions has become a beacon of the wasteland, but still it isn't perfect. Although flawed, the perfections give character to this jewel on nation's crown. Spectacular indeed. Beautiful. Very nice. In the meantime, we're not going to have enough doggos for this, but that's okay. Nice, and it saved us 800-ish manpower. Are we still mobilizing? No, we're not. So that's good. It saved some manpower. Um, in the meantime, let's go do that. Four ways. Let's do that real quick. Train if they need to. Um, yeah, overall, not bad. Uh, I have Doing this campaign has shown me that... Uh, the few changes that the devs have made from when they originally released the Bone Tetris, because I remember when I played this the first time it came through, it was not super easy. This is way smoother than what it has, except for the 80s and the Kaiser's Legion giving them uh, volunteers and whatnot, but 
Oh, this is way smoother. I remember, like, effective total manpower, it was, like, less than, like, 80 or 70% at one point. But now we're at 102%, so that's pretty darn decent. I think that's actually really good for us. Um, I left this open. That's not good. Well. Hmm. Oh, well. We should be able to blitz through here pretty quickly. Especially with all the planes we got, so. If that's the case. Uh, do that. <coughs> do that, too. Building up a lot of roads, which is pretty nice. And getting core more stuff, too, which is pretty awesome. Uh, and I have noticed a, a lot of changes here as well. New assistance care package, that's, always, that's been there for quite a while, which is always very good to do. Daily compliance gain goes up, less resistance growth speed, less resistance target. Military signing bonuses, while it's not cheap, it's not bad. You get more non-core manpower for like three quarters of a year. More weekly manpower, which is decent. It's not bad. Um, raise intelligent, a wasteland intelligence budget. So get faster agency upgrade time. You lose money, quite a bit of money. You can only take this once, but... Adds one oper permanent opera slot to your nation, which I do like quite a bit, so. I'd say that's very much worth it. Getting a fourth operating slot, very nice. Uh, they want to start rebelling. That's a bunch of crap, in my opinion, so no, not today. And never. And you're going to keep it down. Uh, let's go over there. Hey, another division, nice. They can flood through all they want, but as soon as we start going this way, we'll probably catch them soon enough. I'm not super worried. There you go. Side channel attack. Yes, please. More encryption. <coughs> uh, we rejected the followers of the Apocalypse, which was nice. We have the Odeus, Odeus King still. Uh, Sarah Pilgrims. Rhodes of Bowen is so nice. Having that extra attack is so good. Oh my gosh. So my. Oh my gosh. Uh, White Glove Slave Trade. Love it. And ritualized cannibalism is actually very strong. You lose 20% of recruitable population factor, and you don't get a lot of refugees, but you get way better recovery rate, good factor output, good organization, better mobilization speed and political power. I like it. You know, it has its drawbacks, but it has some pros. Some definite pros to it. Dude, we didn't even finish the land docking yet. God dang it. There you go. Better radar, because again... And let's see what our final campaign will be like. After four more things. Um, 18,000, 19,000, oh my gosh. 2,000, 1,000, 1,000. Nice. Very nice. And I want to flood through as much as I can, but, you know, we can also do our damage, too. Look at that. And they're dead. Good. So we're heading this way, because they're going to take over a lot of territory from us. But, oh, well. Oh, we still have training our guys over there, too, huh? So they're going to take a while to get over there. So we're going to do this. We're going to go back to here. Six divisions, huh? You're gonna see, think that that's gonna be enough to hold us back? Yeah, I don't think so, son. Oh, they have stuff up there too. Come on. Ah, uh, improvisation expert, sure, why not? Um, hmm. Let's negotiate it for now. Growth savings loss, not good. Because it's really taking a while to get up to Walla Walla. I'm not sure why. Got it back. That's good though. Nice. Uh, Naval Base gets up. Sure. So they've lost 2,000. And yeah, 40 divisions. That's not bad. 
They certainly screwed themselves over by doing this, though. <coughs> ah, yes, another segment, and they're dead. Aquapires, a little more free manpower. I like that, that addition of free manpower. It's so nice. Especially when you're playing a nation like this when you don't have a lot of manpower, but you know. But perhaps that's just me. Of course, it gives you the option you don't have to take free manpower. Uh, okay, 9,000. We'll take that. Too. Not bad over there, too. Clarkston? Over here, we don't really care too much. He's really good on logistics, or supply consumption. He knows how to really, uh, you know, take in supplies. And we got him! A little pain in the butt, but that's alright. But I think I'm going to end it there. You know, it looks pretty good overall. We didn't get the Nevada Protector, but I don't want to fight the NCR. If you enjoyed the campaign, though, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow. As we'll see what else we can, uh, in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.